The Sports Illustrated poll ranks Matthew Dellavedova the dirtiest player in the NBA, guys. Mm. Is he the dirtiest player in the NBA? Uh, is he the dirtiest player in the NBA? Is this one of those, <laughs> if he's with you, that you say, no, he just plays aggressive and hard and plays the game uh, the old school way. And if he's on another team, you say, that guy's as dirty as anybody I've ever seen on a basketball court. I think it might be some of that. Look, this goes back to last year with the, the Todd Gibson leg yeah. lock and then Kyle Korver who wound up injured and Al Horford. I'm going to stick with that he's old school. He knows that's the way he's got to play bud to keep him viable in the NBA. But he's on that edge, fine line for sure. Well, I think the question I'd, I'd have to ask is, is Danny Ferry still in the league? <laughs> no, okay, so it's Delhi. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's what the poll says. Listen, if you change the word to chippiest, you have the same answer. So I think it's a matter of that definition changing over the years. But by definition today, yes. And you is. know what? Let's stop yeah. being offended about it. You yeah. need a little edge. You need a guy exactly. like Matthew yeah. Bellavidova if well, you want to win a championship. Sure. And remember a couple of years ago, too, it was ever, they changed the block charge rules because of flopping. And who was that for? Anderson Verizhao. And we all <laughs> said, no, 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 no. Not Everybody around the league knows is the biggest flopper in the game. It's one of those, I think. Hey, if it gets the Cavaliers the title, he can be as dirty as he wants. <laughs>